Now we are coming to the another interesting non-living thing that is fire. We understand we understand about the mountain, water, land, soil. Now we are coming to the another ingredient ingredients of water surface that is fire. Because all these are present due to life was possible, due to life happened, it is ignited based on the all these non-living things. We know these five elements. Based on these five elements, life has started. Then fire, immediately fire, once it will come in mind, we will feel heat. And fire having two functions. One it will give you heat, another it will give you the light. Then always fire and light we will try to understand together. Then fire will give you heat and light and light and both heat and light we are getting from sunlight also. Sunlight is a natural source of heat and light and if you are just making artificial source that also can give you the heat and light. Then fire it is a word come from fire and that is Latin word meaning is inflame, excite. Another root word is the pyro. Pyro anywhere if it is used as a you can say prefix most of the times will be used prefix or in a root word in between then you can say words will be related to fire somewhere like pyro works that will be all like uh, uh, you will see like devices and related fire relating fire extinguisher after then fireworks pyrotechnics fire drill fire all these many of the words that will relate to, uh, that will come from the pyro and many of the words are coming from the direct fire Terms related to fire, combustion, flame, after then uh, spark, inflame, 